Now, auto cull using the epoch sets. First of all, we click on the with the zero probe, we click on cull. The cull sign comes up here on the screen, and we click zero offset. That brings up a box which tells us to enter the reading that should be here, the thickness of this area here. The thickness there is 20, so I'll mark this up until it says 20. Right, 20. Uh, then press calibration again. And then we can adjust the, the gate. So I'm now looking at the second echo, which represents 40 millimeters. I then press the velocity key here. And then increase the reading here to, until it says 40. then as it says there press enter and I put the gates back there we've now got a perfect perfect calibration that first deck was reading 20 and this is a 20 millimeter thick sample for the new epoch LTC it's a little bit easier again I'll only calibrate it deliberately So again, we click on cal, and we've got this help now on the F1, F2, and F3 keys, cal thick, cal thin, and cancel. I will click on cal thin, F2, enter the reading, which is 20, this is a 20 mil thick plate. And I'll press the F2, where F1, where it says continue here. And then I'll move the gate to the second echo. And I'll press Cal Thin, Cal Thick on the F1. That's now 40 millimeters. There it says 40. F1 is done and I've now got a perfect calibration again as you can see we've got a reading of 20 mil deep here measuring the exact thickness of this sample now we do have a step wedge and here we can confirm our calibration 12 10 it's 0.1 out for 20 and so on. Step wedge, exit it.